Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And uh, when Windows 8 was introduced uh, many years ago, one of the things that it also introduced but was pretty much unused is a new file system, which is the REFS, or the Resilient File System. So there is different formats of file system on Windows and on PCs. And of course, even on different platforms have their own uh, system that is often incompatible uh, with other systems. Well, one of the things that Windows um, has been actually on for a while now is NTFS, which became the dominant file system that replaced the uh, old FAT32 file system, which had a lot of limitations and at some point was just... Uh, unusable. So came NTFS that added, of course, longer file names and, of course, uh, substructures and folders and that were much longer and added a lot of capabilities. File sizes also increased. And once again, this became the main uh, system for most of the systems that are now today in uh, our computers. As you see here, this is an NTFS drive. And probably, and chances are, pretty much all of you are using NTFS for your computer uh, as it is the default. Now, that could change in the near future as Microsoft is starting to think about pushing REFS to the forefront and have people basically format their drives and a resilient file system, which is different. The resilient file system promises to be a lot better at avoiding, for example, corrupt files, a lot better in the file access times, faster access times, better access times, speedier access times, and also larger files and larger uh, you know, directory structures of every kind. So um, it seems that uh, what is now mostly on servers where it was pushed is coming eventually um, as Windows 11 uh, and Microsoft might be in the near future actually enabling the option that maybe our EFS could be the uh, next time you uh, reformat a hard drive with Windows 11 to install. That would be a possibility. Now, in the latest builds, although disabled, um, the resilient file system features have been popping up. And they are hidden, but there. And that was shown by a uh, user on Twitter called Xeno. So that means that um, maybe we are into a future where a new change of file systems will actually be uh, available. Uh, the good news about it is that Windows natively can read uh, NTFS, FAT32, and REFS. So that means whatever the format of your hard drive or whatever format of hard drive that you get in the future for the file system, well, they'll all be compatible in Windows as they all can be read with Windows 11. So uh, maybe a change coming, of course. You know, as we get better technologies, we get file systems that are files that are huge and uh, have more and more of these really big hard drives and with terabytes and terabytes. And, and that's just increasing all the time. What's going to happen is that uh, there will be a point where NTFS, like FAT32, will reach its capacity, its maximum capacity. It's not there yet. I mean, for most, the majority big, big majority of everyone, uh, NTFS still does a job fine. But there will reach a point where NTFS, like FAT32, will be an obsolete system and we'll have to move on. And so I think Microsoft's looking at the future of file systems by uh, maybe thinking of enabling the resilient file systems in Windows 11. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.